Now, after being developed for the last 32 years, India's indigenously made combat aircraft, the Tejas, may have been handed over to the Indian Air Force last month. But NDTV has learned that it's still very far from fighting fit and is of little use right now. The indigenously made light combat aircraft Tejas roaring into the skies. Last month, the first aircraft handed to the IAF. But it is of little use to the IAF, sources tell NDTV. Crucial training maintenance and training manuals are yet to be made, meaning not only will it be difficult for IAF engineers to maintain the aircraft, but crucially, it cannot even train pilots to fly in. There are some niggling issues with radar, preventing the Tejas from engaging targets that are not visible, which means the Tejas has still some way to go before it is fighting fit. And finally, the IAF still doesn't have the trainer version of the Tejas. The Tejas was to replace these jets, the aging MiG-21, which are infamously referred to as flying coffins. After nearly 48% of all inducted over the years crashed, MiG-21s were to be retired in 2017. But now MiGs will have to fly till 2025. Defence Minister Manohar Parikar has cracked the whip and has asked Hindustan Aeronautics Limited, the defence public sector unit that has manufactured the jets, to come with the crucial manuals by March end. It is crucial for not only does the Air Force need the jets desperately, but being able to produce fighter jets will be a big step towards Make in India. With Shudhiranjan Sen, Vijay Kumar for NDTV.